day to everyone. Uh, in Ukraine it's morning, it's uh, working working day just started. So um, I would like to greet you on our next webinar, which is dedicated to the variable speed drives for artificial lift from uh, Trio Corporation. So in case of any questions, you can just type it in a, in a chat. Uh, if the quality of signal is bad, just also let me know. Uh, the video will be available on our YouTube channel or on triolcorp.com website and our Chinese website as well, triolcorp.cm. So all the materials will be available all the time after this webinar. So let me briefly tell you uh, what we're talking about today. So the agenda is uh, the first part will be uh, introduction to Trio Corporation because I see that some new participants are uh, participating in this webinar. So I will briefly tell about Trio. Most of you know us well, but some new guys will will will, will have something new. And uh, the second part will be about uh, a trio solution for variable speed drives for artificial lift for Chinese markets. We divided the solutions into three parts. First is uh, for domestic onshore market in China. The next is Chinese customers which work overseas. Mainly it's uh, Middle East, Africa and Latin America some Southeast Asia countries, and the third solution will be for offshore application. So this is main three different unique solutions for Chinese customers based on experience we had, based on customer request we got. Also, I will share with you some information about what's new we are working now. Our R&D never stops. So we're working on development of new solutions. So I will briefly tell you about this as well so who doesn't know me let me introduce myself i'm expert sales team leader in asia pacific region which is we are responsible for sales of drill products in china india and southeast asia i joined trio two years ago uh, as account manager now i'm head of the team responsible for sales in apac region so let's let's move to the next slide. This is the history of Trio Corporation. Last week we celebrated uh, anniversary of uh, Trio. It's 25 years. 25 years Trio Corporations uh, has history. So in 1993 we start our business. We were the first private company in post-Soviet countries who started independently manufacturing variable speed drives. Uh, in the 90s, our core market was industrial application, like cement, like steel business, like housing and the water supply, etc. Uh, but uh, in 2000s, we were concentrated on the oil business. Uh, you know that uh, Russia is the biggest ESP market in the world. And Rosneft is the second largest oil company in the world. So. We uh, work very toughly with this oil company and lots of challenges which they put to us, we made. And AK-06 was one of the uh, of this challenge which we developed uh, by ourselves, which we implemented in Russia. And uh, like three, five years ago, we started to, um, to sell it in overseas markets. After 10 years of uh, experience in Russia, we start to expand the business overseas. Uh, so today, what we're offering to overseas markets, it's not only variable speed drives or switchboards. Also, we have medium voltage equipment and downhole sensors. A couple of years ago, we started our innovative technology for marginal wells, linear ESP. Uh, last year, we, all, we had lots of news like uh, certifications we got ce we got ul certified vsds so we can sell to united states canada australia new zealand markets as well european markets so we are moving on 
and uh, proceed with our business. So as of today, we have two main lines of products, as you can see on the slide. The first is for artificial lifts. This is oil business. This is our main segment. This is our like maybe 80, 85 percent of our business. It's uh, variable speed drives for ESP, PCP, uh, hydro, HPS, horizontal pumping systems. Also, it's downhole sensors for ESP and ESPCP and remote control and, sim and monitoring system. And then last but not least is linear ESP. Innovative technology for marginal wells. The second line of products is for industrial applications. First of all, it's medium voltage equipment for different applications. Also, it's low voltage equipment from 3 kilowatts till 2 megawatts for any type of motor for any industry. Also, we have voltage compensator. This is for the customers which had not stable voltage supply. And also, the new business for us is solar inverter because I think green power is the future. So let's move to the, our key products. So our main solution is AK06, which we are talking detail in details later in this webinar. So AK06 and switchboard AK01, this is our main products which can control ESP pump. Uh, also, it's linear ESP, uh, a new technology. It's a complete technology to manage oil production from marginal well. Also, we have downhole sensors, which mostly in, uh, used in ESP business, but it also works for electrical submersible PCP with a downhole motor, submersible motor. We have a huge range of low voltage equipment like AT24 variable frequency drives, like a, a voltage compensator and solar inverters. We have medium voltage equipment at AT27, which is also used for artificial lift to control horizontal pumping system and electrical submersible pump. And we have our own well surveillance uh, software, interactive technology assistant to for remote controlling and monitoring of your equipment. Let's move to the my, 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 my favorite part, our partners. So in China, we have a partner, we have a reliable partner for, for, for who has exclusive rights to sell our drives on several uh, on the several uh, oil fields. This is company Catch, Beijing Catch New Technology Technical Development. This is our reliable customer on Chinese market to penetrate CNBC as on today. But globally, we work with such customers like Baker Hughes, GE, Schlumberger, Novomed, Boretz, uh, Alkariev. Also, we in Russia we work we works with such uh, oil companies like Rosneft, Pashneft, Gazprom Oil, Luke Oil, etc. On this slide, on the map, you can see uh, where our equipment is, is used. The project is red spot and our trio offices, yellow spots. As you can see, trio has representatives in China. We have trio electrical equipment Shanghai, which is for Chinese market. We have our subsidiary in United States in Houston. We have our warehouse with our equipment and we have our office for sales three old trading company. And we already finished our registration in Dubai, free economic zone with three old, uh, Dubai. Also, we have company in two, two factories in Ukraine, one factory in Russia, and uh, we have 11, 11 service centers in Russia and CIS countries. We have more than 1,500 employees, out of them 250 is design engineers. So our R&D department is, is our brain, this is our main advantage, which can, which can customize any product for any customer requests. And uh, as, you, as you heard, as I told, three factories allow us to have full production cycles of key components. 85% of all components of of all parts of our equipment is done by ourselves. Only 15%, one five, is supplied by other companies. Yes, the companies who already visited our our um, factories 
they were impressed because of the whole process of production from the small components from the metal working from the steel laser cut machine and bending and painting everything we have at our facilities so and testing bench the full test procedure ip ip test uh, transportation test load test etc we have here so for chinese markets we prepared several uh, solutions unique solutions especially for chinese uh, in based on our experience which we got all over the world we our uh, more than 10000 wells are equipped by our vsds and uh, in different part of the world we have our drives and mostly every region have own requirements and china is the same they have specific tradition traditions and specific technical requirements for each drives so let's start from the onshore solution in chinese market so as of today based on information we have so the traditional solution is indoor vsd so this is a skid which you can see the blue one on the on the screen it's include step step down transformer uh, input filter to reduce harmonic vsd indoor as usually it's ip20 ip21 six or 12 pulse output filter separate cabinet and step up transformer so as you can see both transformers it's like outdoor only just cage uh, skid but two filters input and output together with the vsd this is in separate control room air ac so with air condition uh, indoor application so it's uh, what i can see is five different cabinets five different five different uh, equipment into one speed into one skid what we see uh, what, what we see is uh, negative parts of such solution so first of all big skid uh, the second is three different cabinets for filters so input vsd output and plus control room with air condition so it's expensive pretty expensive and needs a big skid uh, big footprint so what we have today trio has unique solution this is the solution which we never faced in uh, in other from other suppliers first of all it's six pulse vsd with built-in harmonic input harmonic filter and output sine wave filter so the thd is less than three percent this is a reliable solution which operates in russia and indonesia as well this is outdoor solution with ip 50 54 or nema 3r uh, which already works which already proved so what we propose today is a step down transformer not shift phase transformer it's just regular transformer for six pulse vsd our vsd ak06 with built-in input harmonic filter and with built sine wave filter and step up transformer uh, it should be we, we 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 shouldn't have any control room for this equipment because it can work with plus 50 uh, and uh, for outdoor application but optionally we can propose control room for operator it's just for your technical engineer who can come inside the door in, in, inside the room and see umka controller hmi controller to to control the vsd it's optionally based on customer request it's additional expenses which is not mandatory because because we face in middle east even in egypt even in oman even in indonesia we have a separate uh, simple skid where the people come come to the cage skid and work with our umbra controller outdoor but as i know in china it's traditional to have some control room for, for for safe and comfortable operations 
by engineers. It's an option. It's up to the customer. We can do the whole solution, the full skit, or we can supply only VSD. Because as I know, transformer, transformers is a simple solution which can be supplied by local Chinese supplier. So what is also options? It's our well surveillance. This is reservoir management and production optimization material interactive technology assistance. ITA, ITA solution. This is our own development. This is our own software for remote uh, areas. So for you can just not only monitor but also control the production process of your ESP sitting from your office through the laptop, through the smartphone or tablets which you have. So it's also an, a big advantage. Traditional uh, traditional suppliers of uh, in China of VSDs. It's like industrial suppliers like. Siemens, like ABB, like Schneider, like Danfoss. As usually, they don't have software for for oil application like ITA. So this is our benefit. And what are are the benefit of Triol AK06? It's our Triol controller, Umka. Umka controller. This is a specific controller with a unique software specifically for ESP, for submersible motor aggressive hard environment like long cable line uh, downhole pressure uh, temperature etc and backspin and gas lock and um, solid parts so lots of uh, protections we have in our software and our 25 years experience allow to have one of the best solution for ESP markets uh, I, I forgot to mention that Triol VSDs is approved by the core, the, by the main world suppliers, global VSP supp suppliers like Sambergé, Baker Hughes, GE, Novamed, Boretz, Al Alcoraye, Z-Leaf, Canadian Advance, etc. These customers which buy Triol equipment for their projects. So if you have any questions, could you please uh, put uh, questions in a chat? I will reply. Or you can contact me through uh, through the email or WeChat or telephone. I will reply as well. Or you can put an, uh, a question in YouTube or in our website where we will have this video as well. I know that there are some problems with YouTube limitations, so you can put it through the, our website as well. Any questions, any concerns, any corrections, Please, don't hesitate. So, let's move to the next slide. This is, uh, this is solution for onshore as well, but for the projects of Chinese oil companies overseas. As in today, CNPC, Sinopec, Sinoc operates all over the world, including Indonesia, Iraq, uh, including Oman, UAE, Latin America, South Sudan, etc. So we are also represents we are also operate to supply our equipment in this all these regions and we knew very well requirements for the market. What are the specifics of overseas markets? So first of all it's high ambient temperature. Sometimes it's plus sixty, plus sixty degrees. So mainly it's in Iraq and Kuwait. This is the most hot spot in the world. Uh, we faced some problems you know, with this because no one, no, if, if you if you use control room with air condition, no one air condition supplier manufacturer cannot confirm plus 60 C. So there are lots of limitations for these areas, which is not guaranteed by supplier so overheating is a normal issue normal problem for service companies in iraq especially when you can face a situation when conditioner air conditioner will stop and control room will not be cooled enough and vsd will stop as well so 
the, uh, the pump, the well is stopped, no oil production, well is island. So this is a problem which we faced and which our partners face as well. So plus 60C, it's a huge issue for the area. Yeah, the issue is extra high humidity and salt fog. It's uh, a common problem for um, tropic countries like uh, Indonesia, Ecuador, Colombia. Uh, we had a pro we, we had we had an issue that worldwide world famous brands cannot work with this uh, with this environment. Uh, as usually, uh, ESP suppliers has Nima 3R brands, no Nima 4. So and within one year, within two years, they could be stopped because of high humidity and rustness of the internal part of their VSD. Uh, they all has NEMA 4 solution with NEMA 4 completely sealed and even NEMA 4X, but we will talk about it later for offshore. So for tropic environments, probably it's the one, the only one solution today uh, which can guarantee stable operation in this environment. So as on today, main uh, Main main in ESP suppliers use Triol Nima 4 drives outdoor in extra high humidity. Triol proved this they work the oper stable operation in in Latin America and Southeast Asia by stable reliable operation. What also is the issue for overseas market? It could be remote and hard to get at area. So, for example, it could be jungle, or it could be in desert, or it could be some areas where during rainy season it's not easy to reach. So, for this application, we have a good solution like our VSD with the own software for remote monitoring and control system, which, as I told, industrial manufacturers of VSD doesn't have. And another issue is sometimes we face some concerns that some insects and uh, small animals could, could get inside the VSD. NEMA 4 VSD is also uh, solves this issue. So the main challenges for drives is cooling system, enclosure protection, remote control monitoring system, reliable operation, and huge experience. Solution should be proved in this area and should have positive references. So what Triol is offered as on today, so how we solve plus 60C? Triol NEMA 4 solution has unique own design at Triol facilities cooling system. So specific cooling system, air force cooling with NEMA 4 protection allow Triol to work at plus 60C conditions. We have a testing bench, which confirms this. We have experience in Kuwait, Saudi Arabia, Iraq, which also can guarantee stable work. What is the type technical solution for, for, for this area is to avoid any risks like uh, input filters, like passive filter manufacturing, which is also not there is no proven solution. We don't we don't know who is uh, uh, what manufacturing of what is manufacturer of um, passive filters which can work with plus 60C. We cannot guarantee. No one knows. As far as on today, we don't know these brands which could be used. So to avoid any risk of overheating, we propose next solution: 24 pulse VSD with input sine wave filter which is guarantee stable work with any humidity with 100 percent humidity and with plus 60 c uh, temperature and then temperature and it's for outdoor solution this drive doesn't need any input filter because 24 pulse allow to reduce the harmonics in accordance with thd requirements also you need only step down phase shift transformer and step up transformer transformer which could be supplied by your own from the from the from chinese uh, cost effective sub solutions sub suppliers 
So it also includes Trio Umka HMI controller, and it also could be uh, could be equipped the skid reg especially uh, sim simply cage skid could be equipped by control room specifically for uh, your operator. So it will not work constantly. It will work only when operator can come inside. So which, uh, the operator will switch AC, come inside the room, do his work, and leave the control room. So it's option. Uh, not all companies do this, but we can do this for you. We can do complete skid, or we can supply only BSD. It's up to you, to our customer. So, and also it could be equipped by intelligent technology assistance from Trio as well. For different areas, we, we have different solutions. So what I want to underline and highlight is that Trio has full range of products for like six pulse, 12 pulse, 18 pulse, 24 pulse, which was already proved and work overseas markets. We have different uh, enclosure type for indoor ip20 nemo one very cost effective solution and outdoor like ip54 nemo 3r nemo 4 or even nemo 4x solution could be for plus 40 like our indoor and plus 50 for southeast asia which is okay, which is okay and plus 60c which is for mina region middle east and north africa plus 60c is okay for different regions we have different solution to meet your expectation and to meet your cost uh, in case of questions just or comments or issues concerns just let me know let's move to the third solution which we prepare it's for offshore in china lots of offshore and and uh, some company Chinese operators works in offshore as well in Southeast Asia and Middle East. And I know in Latin America there are some on ongoing tenders for offshore as well. So what we have, uh, what what is the specifics for offshore application? First of all, it's small footprint and uh, high enclosure protection if it is outdoor. Sometimes it's indoor, so it's, it should be simple, like we discussed before. But sometimes it should be outdoor, like stainless steel, NEMA 4 or NEMA 4X. And it should be reliable because any repairing, any operations on the platform is very expensive. So it should be very easy and fast troubleshooting. So what Triol is offering today is first of all it could be indoor or outdoor solution including NEMA 4 and NEMA 4 X protection on the pictures you can see our stainless steel VSD which is already supplied by in China it's worked in China and it's uh, in the United States and the same will be you know in Saudi Arabia probably you know that so Saudi Aramco needs stainless steel so this solution is 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 good for these markets so it's proved and we can do it by ourselves so we, we buy only steel sheets stainless steel sheets rest we do by ourselves so uh, all the old drives has built in sign with filter we don't have additional cabinets for this it's built in our we built in our design based on our design so what 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 customer gets from sign the filter building first of all it's small footprint you don't need separate cabinet or you don't need additional uh, extra um, box connected to the VSD optionally we have for indoor or for NEMA 3R we have built in harmonic filter input harmonic filter so it will be three in one input harmonic filter, VSD and output filter in one cabinet. It's also a very small footprint compared to three different cabinets. So it's reduced footprint, reduced your cost on C platform. 
Another solution which is used in Southeast Asia, it's 18 or 24 pulse, so which doesn't require any input filter at all. So you need phase shift transformer, BSD, sine wave filter, which is also built in in our drives, and a, and a step up transformer as well. So that's all. And we have completely sealed NEMA 4X enclosure with stainless steel for aggressive environments. So this is main different different solution based on your requirements and how we can solve the reliability and easy and fast troubleshooting is first of all we have lots of references and mostly all through all these is well known all over the world so we have lots of positive references on offshore as well like onshore like as well as offshore and we have modular system for fast troubleshooting. Modular system means all our parts, like inverter modules, like capacitors modules, like DC link modules, they are in a separate modular parts which could be easy to replace. You have stored spare parts, it's like one module. In case of any failure, you just plug and play you just remove model of for example inverter and put new one that's all it will take 20 minutes to replace this to continue the operation so this is how we can do it so may, basically we can do may, may we can highlight some specific solutions this is nema 4x stainless steel in case of requirements it's nema 3r with built-in harmonic filters input and output as well and NEMA 4 with modular system which is easy, easy troubleshooting which is guarantee uh, enclosure part based on solution based on requirements so this is what we see which, well, this is what we expect meet your expectation for offshore platforms in case of any questions just let me know and uh, on the next slide we i just want to summarize what our benefits and what our advantages we call ak06 it's universal drive why it's universal it's first of all because it can work with any type of motors it can work the same drives can run synchronous motor induction motor and permanent magnet motor I didn't mention in my presentation that the same drives can work with induction as well as in PMM motors. The reason because in China it's not popular solution. So PMM is becoming more and more popular worldwide, like in the United States and, for example, in Southeast Asia, in India, in Indonesia, in Thailand, in Middle East as well, in Australia and in Latin America, as well as in Russia. Uh, but in Chinese, Chinese customers so far don't see benefits. We need, I think, I think uh, after some times when there will be more and more cases, positive cases, uh, Chinese customers will find some benefits and will start to use, implement and test PMM motors as well. And Triol, the same drive which you use for induction motor today can be used for, in, for PMM motors tomorrow. Because in the world other suppliers it's a few of suppliers which can do one drive for induction motor and the second drive for pmm we can do two in one both in one drive the same drive ak06 can run any type of pump so ak06 can run esp espcp horizontal pumping systems and pcp regular pcp with top drive uh, Trio is universal because we are globally approved by Thunberger, BKQG, Novamir, Talcoraya, Bori, Canadian and Advanced, Z Lift. This is ESP suppliers of induct with induction motor and with PMM motor as well. So we can work with all, all of them. Uh, we can work with uh, different manufacturers of ESPs and sensors as well. So any uh, we have exchange protocols we can communicate 
with any manufacturers of ESPs and sensors. We have a UMCA controller with a very friendly interface. It's intuitive using. Like, you know, like if you have iPhone, with where you can have intuitive understanding what to do, the same you have in UMCA. It's smart, it's very easy to understand. You don't need to, to be learned. You will understand when you see the menu. So, we, it's universal because it can work with minus 40 C outdoor, like in Russian Siberia, plus 60 till dessert, Iraq or Kuwait or Saudi Arabia. It's universal because it can any type of protection like IP20, NEMA1, till outdoor, NEMA3R, IP54, NEMA4, NEMA4X. So it can work anywhere. We have huge power range from 60 kVA till 1500. So power range we can do. We have by our, we have own designs. We have already proven solution for smallest one till the biggest one. Any type of rectifier to meet THD level we have from 6, 12, 18, 24 pulse, input harmonic filter built in, and active rectifier as well, which is mostly using for PCP. And we have built in sine wave filter to reduce output THD level less than 5% in any triol VSDs. So the same sizes which you see for other drives, the same size triol VSDs as usually, but with a with a built-in sine wave filter. So I think it's a, a very good advantage which I want to highlight. Uh, let me move to the next slide, please. Uh, this is a triol new development. This is coming soon. We have a lot of negotiation with our customers so far. We are in process of development of two uh, good solutions. One is unique. The second one, it's also unique, but the technology is not new, but the solution is unique. The first one is multi-drive, triol MP drive for offshore platform to control up to six ESPs. So one drive can, can, can control several ESPs at the same time, not bypass, but the same model, the same moment. We have six, up to six, maybe less, maybe, maybe even more. So far, the target is six inverters, which can independently control your pump. It's two and a half times smaller footprint than traditional solution like 18 pulse, which is used today on the platform. It can be NEMA 4, NEMA 4X, it could be enclosure steel, in, enclosure, enclosure steel, uh, stainless steel uh, metal uh, cabinet. So it's space saving and uh, cost effective solution for offshore platform. So cooling system is uh, could be customized. As on today, it's water cooling system with and uh, 24 pulse. Uh, rectifier, so you don't need any input filter. It's a low voltage drive. You need only uh, voltage supply, 380, 480, and step up transformer uh, for several motors. Six motors, six step up transformers. No input filter, side filter built in. So this is some surprise which we are preparing for the market. The second solution on the right part is real medium voltage drive for ESP. Um, on the picture you see the prototype of 3.3 .3 output for kilovolts. So it's a big one. For the ESP we expect to have like 1.2 or 2.4 kilowatts. It will be small one, it will be like AK06. The same cabinet like AK06 like this one, like on this picture. But it will be uh, three level inverter topology so you don't need any step up and step down transformer so it will be medium voltage vsd which meets your 
TDD expectation and you don't need any transformer at all. So you will you will have voltage supply, for example, 1.2 kilovolts. kilovolts. Yes, probably you will have a step, step down transformer. But on the output, you will have exact voltage you need for your motor. So it will be cost saving. It will be reliable solution and it will be outdoor solution, which can work with uh, our, uh, with plus 60C as well. Mainly, it's it will be targeted for uh, Middle East market, where there is a, a, a enclosure type and temperature type is a big issue. So th this will be a very cost sol cost effective solution and very intelligent solution for outdoor use. For Chinese domestic market, it will be another probably it will be maybe IP54 protection uh, enclosure and maybe we will reduce uh, for till plus 50c so we are working on the design as well so these two solutions we we work in now i think within the next couple of months we will surprise we will we will make some webinar new webinar to to ask you what do you think about it to share some details with you and to get your feedback to, to proceed to proceed with this with this test, testing and uh, proving on the next uh, few slides uh, I would like to share some real applications or real cases which we have the first one is in Oklahoma this is NEMA 4x stainless steel enclosure in the United States variable variable speed drives this is our test with uh, one of the biggest oil company in the world and with our service partner. The next one is in Egypt, in Boretz, um, our the te test of all these. Uh, next is the third one is Venezuela. Yes, I know that Venezuela is hard market because it's not easy to get money back. But we can. We are supplying. It's our huge market. It's one, our, the, one of the biggest markets in Venezuela in the world. So, yeah, yes, we have a reliable partner there, and the financing is, we solve this issue. Next is, next is we are in China. We have several drives in China, so if you decide to test our, your pump with our VSD, we have a drive here at, 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 at the facilities of our partner. So, you can see, you can try, you can test. You can see the menu, you can see the design. So we are, it, it could be done easily within a couple of days. Next, it's in our facilities in United States, the VSD, and also testing with our partner is the United States, our drives. Uh, next slide, this is, you can see me in Indonesia at the workshop of, of our service partners. The Stereol multi motor drives for, for PMM of our service partner. And next is in Kuwait, our partners, our, our team with our drives so at the first workshop of, of Triol, Triol customer. So, this is what we prepared today for you. I hope, I hope it was interesting and it was useful for you. I believe. Um, that it meets your expectation, it meets your technical requirements, and I'm sure that Triol VSD is we will find the right solution to meet your cost expectation as well. Please be sure we can do this. We know how to do this. We control our costs, the full production cycles we do by ourselves. So not only technical part we guarantee, but we can secure the costs as well. So we are finishing our webinars. I would like to thank all, to thank all the participants who attend the webinar. I hope you didn't lose your time and it was useful and just interesting for you. So on the last slide, you can see our website, Chinese website, Chinese language, and uh, our email. 
So you know me, you know my contact details, my colleague just sent it in the chat, my email, you can contact me anytime. And on the website, there is my cell phone number, which is a bit chat as well. So you can call me, you can type me in a message. So thank you very much for your time. We'll be waiting for requests, for, for advices, for concerns from your side. Thank you. Bye-bye.